rules are well known and promised a lot. And today I just want to share a little bit about my journey to the United States. Well, how I ended up over here is um, because so many facts happened uh, back in my home country. But before I explain why I chose to come here, I, will, I would like to introduce you to my home country. I would like to show you the good thing about that place. I really love my home country. They have beautiful beaches. This uh, project was recently made it like in 2020, so it's not that long. And it's one of the most popular places that surf people could go there. So it's really uh, beautiful. They chose to go there. But first of all, uh, I would like to introduce uh, some current presidents that we had uh, through those years. Um, before uh, the civil war that we had over there, um, we had like some uh, disagreements between one people and another, poor and rich, basically. So after that, they did um, some arrangement that they could have peace. But later on, they had like multiple things that could work out between them. So some of those presidents basically just stole some money, made some businesses, and we didn't have any to improve our, our country. Okay, so here is a description. Um, some some images how it was pretty bad my home country. So basically civilians were oppressed uh, and also we had like a lot of drug trafficking, extortion, organized crime and the basically we have it was kind of normal to see people like that. Could you imagine to grow up as a child and just literally just seeing those things is really terrifying. We always have fear. Every time we would go out, we never knew if we wouldn't uh, basically come back. Those are some basically rates. Um, now it's much better. Um, um, now it's better and I had a, a basically to give up my goals and careers I wanted to be a cardiology surgeon I had to sacrifice my professional um, ambition uh, that was my narrative that was a bad goal it was really prestigious but in my own country and also I had to give up my pet my parrot and also Kiera my lovely dog I struggled when I moved to the United States. Basically, language barrier, I was isolated because I couldn't talk and express very really well. Uh, I have some stereotypes from people. They will uh, say, basically, comment, rude comments that why should I, uh, I didn't know language, basically. But of course, I had to give up food had different change on weather to uh, of course discrimination and that's it thank you